an age-old question for you. It's very important. Do I want pie? Do you yes. want pie? Yes. Okay. vlogmas day two it's actually 9 30 right now i just finished my first shift for work and now i have a meeting at 10 o'clock i'm just like waiting to go in because i don't want to it's on zoom it's not like i'm actually like going somewhere i'm going into my house it's, i'm making it sound like i'm at like corporation or something i'm not i'm at my own house but i figured i would update life say hello before going inside because my mom's gonna wanna talk to me and then I'm not gonna remember to do it because I'm a bad vlog misser and it's only day two. Yeah, I have a program lead meeting, which is basically they just tell us all the new things that are happening in the week and what we need to tell our team and any like changes in policies because of COVID, there's always a change in policy. What are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? She's making my cards for my ornaments. She's such a good mom. My little worker elf. I'm gonna tell all the kids that an elf helped me. What does your elf get in return? Um, tea. Or hot chocolate. Or hot chocolate. You wanna hear the crazy thing that happened at work today? To tell. So we weren't allowed to go outside this morning. Cause it's cold out there. Because there was a coyote on our playground. <gasps> oh, no, no, no. So the principal comes in, like whispers to me, he goes, come here, come here, coyote. come here. I was like, okay, and I'm like, oh god, what? why am I in trouble? What, I what did now? I do? I was like, okay, I'm like going through all the things that I've done that probably he won't like. I'm like, ooh. And then he just goes, so you're not allowed to go outside. And like, he's told us before not to like go on the, the grass and stuff because it's muddy. So I'm like, okay, maybe like, because it rained last night, it's muddy. He doesn't want the kids to get muddy. And he goes, there's a coyote. I was like, Meanwhile, oh. You're like, I want to check out the I know, I was like, can I go look at it? He goes, no. I'm like, Okay, he goes, we already called somebody for it. I'm like, but I want to see the coyote. Yeah. But yeah, apparently there was a coyote just running around our, our uh, playground today. Wow. Yeah. But we weren't allowed to. He's like, don't tell the kids. I was like, but I want to tell the kids. Because they'll all be running to the windows wanting to see it too. Yeah, so I wasn't allowed to tell them. They're like, why are we going outside? I'm like, because it's gym day. They're like, we get gym day? I'm like, just today. Because like, we're not allowed to use the gym. So oh. I was cool. like, nope, we're going to the gym. Let's go. But yeah, coyote. Very cool. I woo. You want to hear some first world problems? Uh, mom's complaining about her haircut and how it's not good. At least I have hair, is that what you're saying? <laughs> There's people in the world without <laughs> people hair. People don't have any hair. We are going to go run even more errands for We got work. the last thing figured out for the box. Yeah, we're gonna get beads and string and they're gonna make bracelets. We're going to try to convince them to give it to somebody else because the whole theme of the box is supposed to be acts of kindness, which I have not been following, so... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna go get some beads and string and uh, we're going to Walmart because I have to go get fruit and we're, we're plain rice cakes. Exact, we're going to the exact same places that we went yesterday, but yeah. now even more stuff to buy, so. But then that, just that part of the job will be done. Yeah, and then I just have to build them all. We still have to figure out how to get that done. Because no 41 boxes in one place is crazy. Yeah, based I don't on know our how it's gonna go. Yeah. I'm home from work and I just got a card from Molly, from Magical Molly. She sends me a Christmas card. I always get so excited when they come. Finally came and usually 
it comes like the last week of December because I live in Canada, she lives in the States. Postal service between us always sucks, but it's here and it's so cute and it's so gay and I love that. It says peace everywhere for everyone always. It says, Jay, happy hopeful holidays to you. Love you. We need to Zoom sometime. I will be visiting Canada after Xmas and we can finally hug. Thank you for being an amazing friend these past seven years. Oh my god, we've known each other for seven years? Love Molly. I did not know that we were friends for seven years. I knew that we were friends for like a long time, but seven years? That is insane to me. But she just wrote a book also called Bite Back. So I'm gonna like put a picture here, like a purchasing link down below. Check it out. I gave her book 4.5 out of five stars. I'm gonna talk about it in my wrap up, obviously, because I read it this month, but it is amazing and I had so much fun. It's like a dark academia, vampires, sexy, polyamorous, fun times. And like, just read it. It's so much fun and I love the character so much and I can't wait for book two. But yeah, read Molly's book. I love you, Molly. I can't wait till you come to Canada. But now, like I said, I'm home from work and I need to go shower, but I'm waiting for mom to come back with dinner. I think we're having Wendy's and I'm really excited because I love Wendy's and I get chicken strips every single time and it's so good. And I already had chicken nuggets today for lunch. I had McDonald's and um, I probably should not be eating more takeout fast food, but suck it this is my vlogmas but then i think for the rest of the night i'm probably just going to read i really should edit this video though but i'm reading the grimrose girls by laura full and it is real stinking good so far it's basically about this like university college it might be high school honestly i'm not sure it just says it's an elite school i think they're teenagers so i'm assuming it's high school but an elite school where these four girls attend and one of them ends up dying everybody at the school thinks that it's a suicide but her three remaining friends are convinced that it was not a suicide and that she was murdered and it basically follows these three girls and then a another girl who comes to the school and takes that girl's spot who died and it's basically them trying to solve the murder mystery that happened to their friend but i'm only 174 pages in but i'm loving it so far it's really really fun so that's probably my plans or i'm gonna watch glow up with my mom because we started watching it in the afternoon, hence why I didn't film anything else. But I will show you guys what I bought for the Christmas boxes, because I think they're gonna turn out really cute by the end of it. I will show you that after dinner, but mom's coming home in like 30 seconds, so I'm gonna go eat. Okay, so I need to show you guys what I got for the boxes, because I went to work and didn't show you guys. So this isn't for the box, but I have to buy a present for the principal in the school. So we got quality street chocolate, because that's what we were told we had to buy. So that's what I bought. Each age group is going to have a different thing in their box. So I have kindergartners, grades one to three, and grades four to eight. So the kindergartners are going to have these beads, because they have little tiny hands and can't string beads yet because they're not that coordinated so they have the really big wooden beads and then the grades ones to three we got these beads so they're like a little bit smaller but there's 3200 of them so i should be able to split that between 28 kids hopefully and they can make a little bracelet and then the older guys which is grades four to eight they're gonna make a friendship bracelet so i have like a booklet with friendship bracelet patterns in it so i'm going to photocopy some of those patterns and then give them a little bit of each of the colors of string in this package there's 17 different colors and then they can make a friendship bracelet and then we got like bags to put the confetti and glitter in for the ornaments and then we also got elastic for the beaded bracelets okay so apparently i got a package and i do not know what it is but mommy says i have to show you guys so here you are it's very big i literally have no idea what that is did i order something don't read anything Okay. Did you order something? I'm very confused because I didn't order anything. So you must Maybe have done something. Maybe it's a really big book. It's a very long unboxing. So much tension, so little time. You look very cozy. Oh, it's my diploma. Not your diploma. My degree. There you go. Well, the frame for my degree. Yes, I graduated in case anybody's wondering. Look. Mohawk College. If anybody wants to look me up, that's where I went. Can can they stalk me like that? Maybe. I'm gonna die. Please don't stalk me. Ooh, pie. <laughs> I can say that I made it myself, but 
I did not. You bought it from Sweet, Sweet Paradise. Paradise. Bye. Okay, say bye. Goodbye, Vlogmas. I'm gonna go eat pie now. Mmm.